It's the time of year when a lot of gophers start showing up in people's yards and so I thought I'd do a quick tutorial on how to tell Louisiana pocket gophers from moles because they do require different treatments if you want to try to get rid of them. Um, you notice all these mounds in a row like this? This is a sign of an active gopher. Um, they tend to make kind of round mounds when they're finished but while they are digging they tend to look kind of like a half moon shape. Here's the last couple in this run to give you an idea. They're pushing all the dirt out from this one side and that's why it looks more like a half moon than a total circle. That's while they're digging on them. And then I'll go back down here to the beginning of this long run where there was a couple of active mole runs. Notice in between these gopher mounds you don't see any pushed up dirt. No runs between them, but there's obviously a run under the ground right there between those mounds. Um, but you can't see it because gophers are pretty deep. But if you move over here, you'll see these runs that you can see pushing up the surface. All these runs right through here. Those are pretty obvious there as well. Just a run right under the surface and actually above the surface where they've pushed up the dirt. That is a mole. So that's the obvious way to tell apart. And moles, you do not use the same bait as you would a gopher if you're trying to get rid of them. Moles, you need a good quality grub imitation type bait like talprid mole bait. Whereas the pocket gophers, you need a grain bait. They feed on vegetation, not on grubs and insects. Hope that's helpful.